can you solve today's SATS question? So circle the correct verb form in each underlined pair to complete the passage below. So we have a passage here, and then basically we need to circle one of these in each section. And it's really about the tense and how it reads. And we need to get all of these correct. So one, two, three, four. We need to get them all right to get one mark. So let's have a little look. So we've got William Shakespeare. William Shakespeare, the famous writer, is bought. And my tip here is to not get here and try and solve it. Read on a little bit further and then it'll help you make sense of the sentence. So William Shakespeare, the famous writer, is or was born in Stratford-upon-Avon in 1564. So that is was, all right? So again, just read on a little bit further just to get the context. So we're going to circle that. So let's carry on from here. Was born in Stratford-upon-Avon in 1564 and later will move or move to London. So we're talking about him in the past, so that's going to be moved. Okay, so we're going to highlight that, circle that one as well. To London, where he will become or became an actor. Okay, so again, these are both in that past tense, so we're going to continue the past tense with became, and that reads really nicely. Even today, Shakespeare's plays are performed or performed around the world. So that one's going to be there, because we've got a shift. These three sentences, or two sentences, or even one sentence, is talking about Shakespeare in the past. Then we've got a shift into uh, more of the present. Even today... Shakespeare's plays are performed around the world. So that's the one where it tries to trick you a little bit. Not that they're trying to trick you, but it's testing you. But we have a shift from past to present, so we need to think about that there, okay? So quite simply, my top tip there is to just re always just read a little bit ahead just to get the full context that you need, and reading those questions and getting the right answers should be relatively simple, okay? So that is today's Sats Question Solved.